What's up, all you fuckers? It's time for some more Mass Effect. And today, I am going to start it off by fi finally finishing up that uh, Rogue VI mission. I've been meaning to finish it up. I've been holding off on it. I think it's time. Venus, Mars, Earth, Luna. I think maxing out our tech strength is going to be what benefits us the most in this one. Pretty sure I have to start completely over too, so that'll be fun. Okay, none of them need to be upgraded. Good. Map. This was where that mission was, right? Head to the soul system in the local cluster with the rogue BI on Earth's moon. Yeah. This is going to be a pain in the ass.
I hate this mission. I'm going to save. I know how much of a pain in the ass this last chunk of the mission is going to end up being. I don't know if destroying those actually accomplishes anything, but. Just in case. It's a lot. Oh, I already got that, so. I certainly don't need it. Now nah, I've got it like three times over. Actually, I'm going to save now. Junction.
There now, Garrus isn't poisoned anymore. Rally round. No. Fucking kinetic barriers. Holy leg spike. En route. Huddle up. How did Garrus get poisoned again? Fuck off. Just in case they aren't completely dead yet.
additional security drones. Oh, fuck off. Warm up. Burst of white noise over all frequencies nearly def deafens you. Your hard suit's heads up display drops into a series of zeros and ones. They repeat again and again. Your specialized class will replace your base class and the talents on the squad screen. Talent. Highly trained killing machines, shock troopers excel in all combat situations, increase health, increase damage protection, improves the immunity over barrier or barrier ability, improves the adrenaline ability. Nemesis is a biotic specialist who uses mass effect fields to inflict heavy damage, increase Duration and damage for all biotic abilities improves warp, improves lift. Oh. Well, that mission finally done. Thank fuck for that. Might as well go check out the debris, I guess.
Less attack and biotic protection, but more shields and damage protection. Mm. Nah, we'll deal with that another time. to report that to anybody it's just done mm. oh well the only missions I have left at the moment for like side quests are all shit that I'd probably rather do on my own time. So, we are not going to go for Meyer because that's, no. So I guess we're going to Novaria. Tell me I can't scan any of these. There we go. Oh, matriarch writing discovered. Oh, all right then. Control, this is the SSV Normandy, requesting a vector and a berth. Normandy, your arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a Council Spectre aboard. Landing access granted, Normandy. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. What a fun bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. I'm going to take Doctor to Sony. And a Linko. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Who the fuck do you think you are? That's far enough. Something wrong, officer? You better hope there isn't. 
This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. You first. We're the law here. Show some respect. I'm Captain Maiko Matsuo, Elanis Risk Control Services. I'm a Spectre. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, man. We will need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not permitted on Novaria. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. Are we gonna let them do this, Commander? Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, three. We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. I'm sure Parasini san will answer any questions you have. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I can't have my investigation hampered. Tread lightly. The board can bury you in litigation. You'd need an Asari lawyer to see the case through. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Benezia? She is here? Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Could you tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. She is here. I can't believe it. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. No, we don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're a part of my crew. Thank you, Shepard. That means a great deal to me. to Port Hanshan, the galaxy's most respected site for independent scientific research and development. For your own safety and to protect the privacy of others, you are required to obey any directions given by our security personnel. If you have questions or concerns, our friendly administrative staff is always available. Thank you, and enjoy your stay. Friendly, huh? Hmm. The managers warned us about you. This one offers greetings. You are the specter that visits Port Hanchan. News travels fast here. Indeed, esteemed specter. Your arrival was not greeted with any joy by the companies here. This one has a burden that you could ease. If an arrangement could be made, it would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, 
but you could bring it through customs. You want me to use my status to smuggle for you? That is not inaccurate. I have no problem with that. This one humbly thanks the Spectre. The package will be delivered to your vessel. All you need do is bring it to this one. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy... fees. Is there anything else this one might help you with? I'm just browsing right now. This one awaits your return. What a bunch of shady motherfuckers. Greetings, Spectre. Have you brought the package? Here you are. The Spectre has done a great service for this one. From the deepness of light, it thanks you. This one promised compensation for services rendered. It humbly suggests that a sum of 250 credits would be most appropriate. Would you have had any chance of getting this past customs without me? You can be a bit more generous. The other's words possess the discomforting ring of truth. This one could raise the sum to 500 credits. That is half this one's profit taken by the other. It can offer no more. That's thoughtful of you. <laughs> this one is glad to have come to an agreement. I'm just browsing right now. This one awaits your return. I'm on duty, Spectre. I shouldn't be talking to you. That's nah, not very nice of you. I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas? Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. Right, fine, come in. You will excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain refugees from that urban blight called Earth. I see you looked up my service record. Only a fool enters negotiation without knowledge of the other party's tendencies. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. 
Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. Are you telling me you have no safety protocols? Don't be ridiculous. Do you think a for-profit company would take no precautions against loss of life and material? Project leads have the final say here, not meddlesome politicians. Do you do business with Saren? Agent Saren? One of your Spectre compatriots? He is a major investor in Binary Helix Corporation, which is one of Novaria's backers. Is Binary Helix developing weapons for him? It's possible, given his interests. What our clients do in their labs is their business. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Benezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at peak 15. What can you tell me about her cargo? Large, heavy, and sealed. It passed weapon screening. Beyond that, it is not our concern. What do you mean, personal escort? The phrase is self-explanatory. Bodyguards attending to the safety of her person, mainly Asari commandos. And you didn't think that odd? They followed all our regulations. I had no reason to forbid Lady Benezia from taking them. I'd like to see her, immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. Surface access, you say? Cut off, I said. The roads are not suitable for travel. Don't make an issue of this, Shepard. Forget him, Commander. If he won't play ball, I'm sure someone else here will. What brought her out here? If I knew, I wouldn't be at liberty to say. She came here as Agent Saren's executor. She is here on business for Binary Helix. There were issues at Peak 15 that required Saren's attention. I have no more questions at this time. Good. I received a dozen urgent messages while you were about. Wow. Mr. Analeus isn't the only one with a path to leave Hunchen. You've never worked in the corporate world, have you, Commander? You can't bludgeon through bureaucracy. So it would seem. I need an alternative. Talk to Lorik Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not with an earshot of Mr. Analeus. Talk to you later. Very well. this the elevator I need to take or elevator to hotel elevator to synthetic insights yeah this is the one I need human at the hotel bar he's a sales rep for binary helix his name is Raphael Vargas I need you to speak with him do you know who I am everyone here knows who you are Dalstone. that makes you ideal for my job you are a known quantity or so Vargas will think he will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry that will distract him from your my real intentions I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What's your interest in Binary Helix? They do genetics work. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. 
Discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate binary helix when he logs onto their intranet. What's in it for me? Money, of course. I would be well paid for this. So would you. 500 credits. Interesting plan. I'm in. Excellent. Here's the cracking device. You will know it is done when it beeps. I have assembled a dossier on Vargas. If you would like, I could brief you on his behavior patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. I'll go see him now. I hope you will. Vargas, I'm Commander Shepard, a Spectre. I understand you work for Binary Helix. That's correct. Rafael Vargas, sales. Were you interested? I might be. That depends on what sort of offer your company can make. It was my understanding that the Citadel contracted to a Solarian Corporation for its enhancement programs. I'm sure you know that we pass a new budget every fiscal year. If it delivers a better soldier, contracts can change. A sound business practice. Excuse my hesitation, I've never heard a government accused of a good business sense. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. You can maximize the odds, but every strand of DNA is unique. Our patented techniques can provide an 8% improvement in adrenal response, 12% faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in CG muscle degeneracy. I've never heard of the technique that improves zero gravity endurance. It's a first for the industry. The advent of element zero based artificial gravity made it a less pressing concern. We're still waiting for tests to give us an average improvement. We estimate a 7 to 11% decrease in muscle loss rates. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. For a bulk order, I can work in a sensory enhancement package, guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. How would you distribute the upgrades? Retroviral injections would take some time. Hmm. Well, it does take time to upgrade a body with adjusted DNA. Skin cells could be replaced in two weeks, but the liver takes over a year, a skeleton a decade. For frontline units, we can speed the process with full system transfusions and injections to stimulate regrowth. It would still take six months to see results. I have to admit, it surprised me that you were here for business. There are many development projects on the very some not entirely legal. If you have any tips, I'd appreciate them. It would reflect well on you and binary feelings. I'll keep that in mind. Of course, we don't perform espionage on our competitors. That would be illegal. Sorry, Mr. Vargas. That's a call I have to take. Thank you for your time. Of course, Commander Shepard. Any results? Your toy did its job. Excellent. I will transfer 500 credits to your account. Only 500. All right. Thought you might have wanted to provide more since you couldn't do it yourself. I mean. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. <coughs> Good day, Spectre. <sighs> Alright, well, I guess we'll upgrade this. Max out warp. Begin upgrading lift.
afternoon. Sit down, have a drink. What can I do for you? Are you Laura Keen? I heard you might be able to help me. You are the Spectre that just arrived, are you not? What can an old Turian like me possibly help you with? I'm trying to find a way into the garage. I have places to go. You need a pass. How fortuitous. I'm the manager of the local Synthetic Insights office. For the moment, at least. Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of Rents. I sense a connection there. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas' actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the... lotion? Violence against Mr. Analeas' thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment.
course. Go figure. I'm sure I'm fucking. I'll focus on trying to get your evidence. If I'm lucky, I won't have to fight anyone. Excellent. Here is my passage to our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD can be to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep blood stains off the carpets, would you? What's up, Rocky? You're the specter. Well, that's nice, so yeah. Nothing down here. Who's this? Read it. Oh. Unauthorized transmission. Not sure if you will receive this, Doctor, but... Head to the Newton station in the Kepler Verge and warn the doctor. Newton system Kepler Verge. Well, can't exactly do that now. Nothing down here, right? Like what? What's back here? Nothing. Okay. Oh. Freeze! 
Shenzhen security. This office is sealed. Lorik Keen gave me a pass in. Keen? Are you working for him? He's under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. Does Captain Matsuo know you're here? Hey, I'm not the one who wants Keen. Analeas has a Varen up his ass about this. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. Works for me. You downloaded the evidence from Laura Keene's computer. What the fuck? Where did you come from? I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. You have me at a disadvantage, miss. Oh, now you're gonna show some respect? I'm Sergeant Kyra Sterling, Ilanis Risk Control Services. Analeas would throw you off world for what you did here. I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? Being a cop doesn't give you the right to break the law yourself. You accepted bribe money. I didn't want to fight them, they fired first. Well, I don't need a gun to rip you to pieces.
Well, that sucks. Probably should have played nice with me when you had the chance. I swear I saw something up here about oh what the high explosive rounds nine Jesus Christ I could have swore I saw, uh, saw something else that I could have snagged. Whatever. There it is. Striker 9. Yeah, that's me. I used to be a military tech. Except for my ego's people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. What can I do for you today? How can I get into the garage? You need a pass. You can get one from Analeas or the managers. If you can polish enough gizzard. Maybe you could let me borrow yours? Sure. If I wanted to lose my job and get sued into the next spiral arm, security tracks card use. I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here. Oh, hello again. Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? It's probably Analeas's thugs ripping the place apart. Smart ass, huh? That's fine. I can work with that. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Allow me to reintroduce myself. Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Why is an internal affairs agent here? The executive board knows about Analeas's corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With this evidence, this planet can run profitably again. I need Keen's garage pass to complete my mission. You help my investigation, I'll provide whatever you need. Favor for a favor. Seems we'd help more people if we did as she asks. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You Spectres play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. All right. 
I'll talk to Kane and see if I can convince him. Thank you. You know where I work. Come talk to me once you know if he'll play ball. Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Enelaus. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. Everyone on this station is chafing under Analeas' extortion. You might end up a hero. My employers rely on the goodwill of the executive board to work here. The board is investigating Analeas. They'll be more angry at him than at you. All right. It is obvious that I cannot dissuade you. Very well. I will testify. Holy shit, a plus 24 to my Paragon. Hey, Max Stone Paragon. Make whatever arrangements you need with your contact. I will wait here. Sergeant Sterling was killed. Only the one responsible and guilty of trying to kill Good luck with that. My sergeant was killed in the SI office. I don't know how I feel about that. She was brutal. Spectre, have you given any more consideration to my offer? It took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. <laughs> I didn't think you'd help me, being a Spectre and all. I guess some of you can be alright. So, how about getting me into the garage? While you were working on Keen, I got you a garage pass. Be careful up there. I have an arrest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate skirts. <laughs> this is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. You, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! You have the right to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. <laughs> you're on the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. Alrighty, well, I probably should cut off the episode here since the next part is going to be entirely different. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in. If you like my work, feel free to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, peace.